Hi, I'm Ali and a warm welcome to Face Yoga Master. So in today's video, I thought I would share with you how to reduce those frown lines between the eyebrows here with an amazing facial massage. We're going to do some great massage exercises to really help reduce and also even just prevent those frown lines which can develop here over a period of time and then finish off with the all important lymphatic drainage massage release. Now I do like to start with clean skin and you will need a form of slip so we're not compromising the skin by dragging and pulling at it. So I do have some facial oil here. If you have a face cream, that's fine too. Although I do tend to find facial oil, you do tend to get a better slip and glide if you like. So just applying literally where the elevens is can develop and also above the eyebrows towards the temples, side of the ears and the side of the neck. So first of all, with the fingers, I'm just gently massaging in an upwards motion between the third eye and working along to the eyebrow. And then I'm going to place my fingers between the eyes and just above, space them out slightly, and we're just going to take our finger and really massage the area. And then you want this to be fairly deep. And then the other way. Be mindful to make sure that your face is nice and relaxed. And then again, just massage it out. Now with my fingers here, you tend to find that your, you have your lines going up vertically. So we're going to work horizontally in a different direction. In a zigzag motion, all along. And whatever product you placed onto your your skin, your face if you like, is actually going to penetrate in even deeper. And just keep working that along. And then you just want to work in a slightly different direction. And this will actually also help release any tight fascia in this area. And just keep working all along there. And then back to horizontal. And then again, massaging upwards. And then with the fingers, we're just working our way. We're going up and slightly across. Always try to be mindful during the daytime to keep the face nice and relaxed. Sometimes we can hold a lot of tension in our face and by holding tension in our face, we can actually create some of these lines. And then just massage very lightly between the eyes. And just massaging one way and then the other. Now with the finger here, I'm just going to press it. It's a great acupressure point here. And then again, just massage in an upwards motion. Heading towards the hairline and then across from the eyebrows and then the other way. Now with the fingers here, I'm just gently moving outwards again. And then slowly the whole of the forehead. And this is a light touch. We're actually moving toxins and waste within the lymph. And the lymph is close to the surface of the skin. So just nice and delicate towards the temples. And then you want to take the ring finger between the eyes here and just gently glide down side of the nose and then massage 
either side of the nostrils and glide under the cheekbones towards the ears. And then massage the side of the temples towards the ears again. And then make a V-shape either side of the ears and just massage in a downwards motion. You may feel things, you may want to swallow, you feel things moving around when we're moving lymph. And then just take the fingers and then massage above the ears. Again, we have plenty of lymph nodes around the ear area. And then you want to massage along the occipital bone, basically the bottom of the head, top of the neck. Round circular motions, nice and light. And when the fingers are touching, just gently glide down either side of the neck, down this big SEM muscle to the collarbone. And then from the chin all the way down where our collarbone is, just above we have some indentations. And if you can just give these a few gentle presses, this will release all the toxins and waste we've moved within this forehead area and actually helping to reduce and prevent and eliminate those horrible frown lines between the eyes. Now, please consider subscribing if you're not already subscribed for more content and a thumbs up if you found it useful and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Okay, bye.